the tale of the Mother's Day pie. Mother's Day and leave your shopping to the last minute. <sighs> For the record, I definitely did not forget that today is Mother's Day. I just remembered too late. <laughs> That's all. Happy Mother's Day! <laughs> oh my! A brand new apron. I picked it out myself. Yes, but I chose the colour. And look. A homemade quilt. Oh, and turnip-scented candles. The candles were my idea, Mum. Yes, but I picked turnip. Oh, girls, you shouldn't have. <laughs> <laughs> ah! oh, and look, even little Cottontail made you a present. Oh. <laughs> The only present any mother needs on Mother's Day is a hug from her children. But thank you. Thank you, everyone. Looks like someone forgot. Who? Me? Uh, I didn't forget. Did I, Benjamin? <laughs> no. Um, he just sort of remembered too late. He remembered that it would be better to give you your Mother's Day present later. Right, Peter? Uh-huh. Later. I just... I need to put the finishing touches on it, that's all. Finishing touches? On what exactly? Only on the best Mother's Day present ever. And so I guess I'd better go do that right now. Bye. Whoa. Whoa. Huh? <sighs> what are you doing? Looking for... My dad's journal. I saw something once. Um, aha, found it. Good old Dad. He put all his best ideas in here. Wow. Instructions on how to make Mum's favourite treat in the whole world. Wild strawberry pie. Mm. Come on. <laughs> I have a great idea. Why don't the three of you go out for a nice Mother's Day walk through the countryside? Well, I suppose that does sound rather nice. Where should we go? Anywhere. Go and enjoy yourself. In fact, why don't you take the whole day? Peter, you wouldn't by any chance be trying to get rid of us, would you? Get rid of you? <laughs> get rid of you? Me? Ha! <laughs> Me! <laughs> you too, Cottontail. You'd love a walk, wouldn't you? Yes, Cottontail, a nice walk. Yay! Let's hop to it. We've got to make that pie before Mum gets back. Right. We just need to gather all the ingredients your dad wrote down in the journal. One cup of sugar, two cups of cream, one stick of butter. Benjamin, we need a mixing bowl. Uh, and a large spoon. And a rolling pin, oh. and measuring cups, and a pie tin, Wait, wait, and... wait. Slow down. My brain's too full. Ugh. We'll be right back. We're going to get the rest of the ingredients. Not least, 
four cups of berries. <gasps> oh no! The berries! They're all gone! Hmm. What are we going to do, Peter? No berry pie means no present for Mum. <gasps> Whoa! What happened in here? Phew! This spoon just did not want to be found. Uh, thanks, Benjamin. But without berries, we can't make a pie. Oh, it looks so yummy too. What's that? Whoa, it's magic! No, it, it's some kind of invisible ink. It's the lemon juice. It's making the words appear. It's not just words. It looks like Dad's drawn a secret map. A map? Yes, and it leads to a wild strawberry bush. One with the biggest and juiciest berries ever. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> There it is. Just like the picture. Oh, thanks, Dad. Um, Peter, there's just one thing the map didn't tell us. Mm. The bush with the biggest and juiciest berries ever is in Mr. Todd's private garden. We have to get out of here. No way. Without the berries, there's, there's no, no wild strawberry, strawberry pie. pie. And I am not going back without a gift for Mother's Day. It's awfully dangerous, Peter. Mr Todd might catch us. Ah, but he won't. He'd never expect that the three of us would ever be this... Careless? Crazy? I was going to say this close to his berry bush. Now, we're going to need something to carry all of these. Keep picking and stay out of sight. I'll be right back. We really should be leaving right now. Leaving so soon? <gasps> Oh, no, no, no. I really must insist you both stay for dinner. Psst. I got his basket and there's no sign of Mr Todd. Lily? Benjamin? <gasps> Let us go! Oh, no! Strawberry pie, you say? Um, that's right. In fact, if you let us go, we'd be happy to make one for you, wouldn't we, Benjamin? Yes, you'll probably be so full that you wouldn't even have room to eat your... your... My rabbit dinner? Nice try. But I can always find room for rabbit. Now, I just need to check the seasoning. Um, rosemary, thyme... Hey! Try a little oh. pepper! <laughs> Peter Rabbit! <laughs> Come on, let's hop to it! <laughs> Run! Oh, no! Not so far. <laughs> Rabbit's not off the menu yet. <laughs> we'll try adding berries to the menu. <laughs> the door's blocked. Come on, this way. <laughs> How do we get down? Try the steps. Uh, very clever, Peter. <laughs> I'm sorry, Peter. The berries were all I had to trip him with. <sighs> I guess that means no pie for your mum, Peter. Sorry. It's my fault. Not yours. I'm the one who forgot it was Mother's Day. 
Peter, where have you been? And who left the kitchen in such a dreadful mess? Peter, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I thought I could make you a wild strawberry pie for Mother's Day. I tried, but, well, we couldn't get the berries. I'm really, really sorry, Mum. Oh, Peter, I told you. The only present any mother needs on Mother's Day is a hug from her children. And it looks like the only thing that your pie here needs are the berries. <gasps> Wild strawberry jam? What can I say? It's my favorite. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Now let's make that pie. <laughs> 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 